Alright guys, how's it going? I'm considering this a continuation of the video tabs and panels. Now I'll be completely honest here, videos of this nature generally don't generate enough views, but I actually feel as if they hold more value or merit. It's kind of one of these strange trade-offs you get with YouTube. Maybe I need to start making videos as Blender better than Houdini. <laughs> But the reason I'm calling it a continuation is simply because of a user question. And he basically asks, The first icon in the bar, active tool and workspace settings, I have my doubts about its function, could you please explain? So I'll try my best, so we'll open up Blender here. And essentially what the user is talking about is this kind of screwdriver and spanner. Now this panel here is your active tool. Now it's kind of self-explanatory. But anything that you select, it will give you kind of a properties for. So um, if I go to transform, you can see here I have different options. And it just means if you do something like you hide the header, that you always have some representation of the tool working. And that's pretty much it. It is the active tool. Now one thing you may have noticed is that you have workspace under here. So if I open the bar on the right hand side, I have all the plugins on the right hand side here. Now sometimes this can get pretty messy. So if I actually click on filter add-ons, I can individually select what add-on I would like displayed. So let's pick the plugin that I wrote. And that means only that tool is pretty much visible. Now if we take filter add-ons off, everything comes back to normal. Now you're probably thinking, why would you need this? Well let's say for example, I come up to workspace and I duplicate the current. Now it's called layout0001, I'm going to double click on this and I'm going to call it quad view. Now just to make things a little bit tidier, I'm going to go to Window, and I'm going to go to Toggle Full Screen. We have a little bit more workspace now. Now, Quad View, the shortcut for this is Control, Alt and Q. It's kind of strange, you would think it would quit the program. So Control, Alt and Q will toggle Quad View. The next thing I'm going to do here is, I only want my tool available. So I'll come back to Filter Add-ons. My tool selected. So if I jump into Layout, you'll notice that there's a different setup, and this is me essentially filtering the workspace. So this is great if you model, because it means you can have different plugins and different workspaces. Now if you hit control and space, it'll expand any window that you're hovered over, so if you want to quickly do something like this. So that's pretty much the basics of Active Tool and Workspace. Again, I apologise, I know these videos are kind of basic, but do me a favour guys, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, follow me on Twitter, and